Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be opening up something really interesting here. This here is a very different product from what we usually would be opening up, which is cards. In this particular case, I have this really cool premium binder set here. So this is, I believe, an actual official Bandai product because it is actually including the um, certain promo cards for the Digimon card game. And these are essentially the reprints in alternate art form for pretty much the most uh, popular cards um, out there. So in this particular case, it is going to be themed after uh, Beelzmon as well as Beelstarmon. And um, yeah, with that being said, we get this nice binder which we'll open up soon and take a look at. Uh, both sides should have some uh, printing of uh, Beelzmon on one side and Beelstarmon on the other side. Uh, of course, the cards itself, we are getting two copies of each card, which makes eight cards. Definitely fantastic. Would I buy a second one just so that I could have a playset of all the cards? Maybe. That is definitely a consideration just because of how nice the artwork is. So to be able to get a playset of it just to add to your decks would be pretty nice. Not to mention, a binder is a binder. You could ultimately use it to... Uh, store up your collection otherwise if not store up cards that uh, you're not going to be using for the time being uh, you might pick up later on down the line uh, but that's as simple as this product will really get i am definitely very excited to open this up there's just so much to it the artwork is absolutely amazing for what it is and without further ado let's just begin of course if you guys do end up enjoying this video, please drop a like, share, comment, and subscribe. It really does help out the channel. And at the very least, just watch one more video. It means a lot. So, let's get this opened up here. There's a bit of tape on the sides, so I'm just going to take this, and hopefully I don't damage anything on the inside. Um, same thing on the other side here as well. Just going to use the tape to get that open. Um, and I believe we should just be able to, okay, there we go. So we should just be able to open that up there. And I'm just taking out the cards. So it uh, looks like the box itself is empty on the inside. So there's nothing else to it. Um, that being said though, the binder is already looking amazing. So here's the cards. Seems like they just taped it on. Let's get it off without actually uh, bending the cards or anything like that. So just trying to be careful here. So I have Bill Starmon, which uh, actually looks amazing by the way. Um, but that being said, let's get all this tape out and uh, we'll see what cards there actually is. We'll confirm pretty much uh, what each of these cards will be. Uh, that being said, I'll just get to it later on. So I'll set that aside for now. Uh, right now, what I want to do is I do want to open up the uh, binder itself to show you guys how it actually looks. So, just um, peel this part off and we can take out the binder. Just get it out of the wrapping there. And we'll set that aside and wow look at that it's actually um, embossed so you could actually definitely feel this very nice texture here um, it's quite stunning I mean the camera actually does a pretty good job at uh, accentuating all that texture that you see there um, you could definitely see great quality throughout this particular product so yeah definitely very nice there um, it feels really smooth as well just a really nice uh, binder I was genuinely thinking that it would be a suede material uh, definitely not this is a really nice um, it's almost like the fake leather feel essentially but I kind of like that to be honest because it's nice and smooth uh, so that's Beals, uh, Bealsmon right there. 
looking really nice and on the back here we have our uh, Beo Starmon definitely a very nice piece of art to behold so again similar case a lot of texture throughout this here and it just looks uh, quite stunning I'll be able to bring up some close-ups to each of these so that you guys could actually see the quality of the binder itself is definitely well made uh, that just goes to show that uh, if you're getting anything from Bandai which is pretty much an official company you don't have to worry too much about the quality control here because uh, you could expect it to be at the top of its game so we are actually having this uh, zip binder here so let's get this uh, opened up um, that binder is very smooth when opening up as well so I'm very impressed I uh, got this nice uh, felt like material here uh, you can see it's sort of like you can draw a bit on it so definitely very nice um, to actually feel up but uh, this is the binder itself it is a uh, PVC free binder so you don't have to worry too much about your cards getting damaged on the inside. That being said, if you are going to put your cards into this binder, please definitely um, sleeve up your cards prior to that. But with that being said, let's uh, just put this binder on the side here because now we're going to be taking a look at each of these cards. Right here, I can already see the Beal Starmon. It looks really nice, by the way. So let's just uh, get everything opened up. And uh, let's take a look at each of our cards. So right here, we are looking at Beal Starmon. An absolutely beautiful card. I'm going to just bring it up close for you guys to see. Um, just looking amazing so this is the one from bt6 so definitely very interesting here to see um, we do get two copies of it so i'm definitely very pleased about that and like i said if you ever want to just complete a play set then you just need to buy one more of these products and you'll get the other two copies uh, next up we have here our lucimon chaos mode from bt7 this is an incredibly powerful card that is played in pretty much every single Beelzmon deck out there so if you're not playing it definitely get your hands on this and here's the thing this particular card is sitting at about $25, $26 very expensive, very pricey and that's only for one copy uh, I believe you could definitely get away with playing just two copies in a deck but with that being said you could easily now get this. It's great that it is now accessible because um, it is now pretty much within this particular binder itself. So uh, yeah, definitely fantastic. And of course, this new Alterna artwork looks beautiful. So next up, we have over here our Beelzmon X Antibody, a fantastic card from BT12. Um, definitely really powerful as well uh, this card is essentially just a game ender here because you're essentially just trashing your opponent's security stack uh, based on every 10 cards in your trash mind you you could pretty much just empty out your opponent's entire security stack and uh, go for one final attack win the game pretty simple um, so yeah very nice there but Honestly, like I said, you could just get away with playing two copies of this as well in a deck. You uh, wouldn't need to get a playset or anything like that. Of course, our final card, our most important card, is Beelzmon himself. This is EX2 Beelzmon, one of the best versions of Beelzmon out there. So it's absolutely fantastic absolutely powerful this is one of the cards where i genuinely would actually try to play two copies of ah uh, sorry four copies of in a deck so i do actually own two copies um, of the original ex2 artwork so to be able to play this alternate artwork complete a play set of the ex2 billsmon is definitely going to be well worthwhile but uh yeah that's essentially it here 
honestly, after further review of this, I'm finding that you probably only need two copies of each card anyway. There's no need to get a playset. So if you don't want to have a duplicate binder, you could just buy one of these, have this very nice binder, but then also have two copies each of this beautiful full artwork that is alternate to the art of the uh, cards itself that have already existed. Definitely very nice here. I really can't say much else about this. Everything here is stunning. Everything here is just beautiful, well made. Uh, props to Bandai for actually releasing such an awesome product. But of course, I would like to hear what you guys actually think about this as well. So definitely drop a comment down below and let me know your thoughts. And if you like this video, drop a like, share it, and subscribe for more videos like this. But with that being said, thanks for joining me today. I hope you all have a fantastic day. See you next time.